On Tuesday, April 29th, at a conference in New York, the NBA Commissioner Adam Silver announced that the Los Angeles Clippers owner, Donald Sterling, has been banned for life by the league. In response to racist comments, the league says he made in a recorded conversation. Sterling asked the woman on tape, It bothers me a lot that you want to broadcast that you're associating with black people. Do you have to? We asked students at Healdsburg High School if they think racism exists on a high school campus and why. I think that racism finds its way onto high school campuses, especially, you know, you wouldn't really think Hillsburg High, but indirectly I think that there is a little bit of racism everywhere. Um, I mean, whether it's like subliminal, subliminally in media, um, or just like at, like anywhere you see, or like it's how you're raised, or even if people don't like maliciously intend to be racist, there's sort of, I think, bits of racism everywhere that's kind of hard to get away from. Yes, I do, because I'm constantly hearing people making racist comments and jokes around campus. Okay, there is racism in school campus because many people get laughed at because they're black, Asian, Mexican, or other kind of culture there they are. And I think it really hurts their feelings. Yes, I do believe racism exists in this school because there are certain groups in the school that separate themselves because they feel that there is racism and they feel that they will, wouldn't fit in with the other groups. So like the group over here that um, Little Mexico, they call it Little Mexico, or like uh, the, the white people, they hang out in like the senior court or sophomore court. And that is a good example of racism right there. I do believe racism exists in the high school campus because there's a lot of racial um, fights and stuff. People don't like each other just because of the race and they don't even know each other. So I, I really do believe there is racism in schools. Yes, because it's pretty obvious when there's two separate sides of the school and one race is on one side and another race is on the other. Uh, yeah, I, I, I've seen a lot of it on campus and most of the time I see kids just getting fights. So. It's definitely been kind of a scary experience sometimes, but most of the time, kids just ignore it. And I like to see the other kids just get pissed off because they can't get a while out of it. But yeah, I think there is, but I think most of the time kids over overpower it because they're smarter than that.